Hey everyone, what's up? Newbie Snake here. How are y'all doing today? Alright, so I'm just going to assume everyone knows where I've been for the past two weeks by now. If you're still wondering where I've been for the past two weeks, please feel free to check out one of my latest video titled, I'm Done Moving. Otherwise, let's continue with our video. So I'm just going to spend some time going through what has already happened that I believe 90% of you already know, but I'd like to cover it just in case the players who play on the Japanese version doesn't know about them yet. And then I'll go and talk about all the new stuff, all right? So let's get started. Okay, so first up, we have the old news, all right? So not the new news, which is max character list number increased, all right? So for those of you who have been playing on the Japanese version who have no clue about these at all, uh, this is why I'm doing this for you guys, all right? So uh, if you guys have noticed that your inventory box has been increased, the reason is because the game has increased it for us, all right? So the starting character list slots has been raised from 30 to 100. That means we have gotten about 70 slots for free. But if you need to increase your current max capacity, your slots, then you still need to spend Ninja Pearls, all right? But then um, everyone has or should have had their inventory box increased for free, all right? And then at the next stop, as I mentioned in one of my uh, previous videos, like two weeks prior, um, I've talked about, you know, entering the Shippuden phase and we have already entered the Shippuden phase. And to celebrate that, they have uh, introduced what Sasori and Deidara, right? That's the first Akatsuki or Shippuden event. And then also in order to celebrate that, they have um, reduced the difficulty as well as the stamina for the ramen report missions you know the missions where you get ramen uh i believe as well as the scrolls one but we'll have to check that out uh anyways now you can awaken three stars ramen into four stars ramen as well okay so i'm not gonna go through the hinata one because this only applies to uh, the english version so you guys can check this out uh if you guys want and then over here uh the more recent news is that we have the all new limit break characters again this applies to both Japanese and English version we have the Shikamaru uh, the subtitle is lazy guy and then we have Choji uh, this one all right so over here this is just a full list of the available uh, limit break characters okay so I'm just I'm not gonna go and read through every single one of them if you guys want just feel free to pause the screen and then check out um, the characters and and their uh, titles all right so you guys will know which one they are all right so now let's move on to the next one okay so we're going by rather quickly pretty pretty nice all right so over here uh this is the one i've also mentioned before uh this is the getting rich quick mission all right so now uh every single day uh again this uh the time i believe happens well i believe this time is only for the English version. The Japanese version might have a different time, but I might be wrong because most of the times in Naruto Ultimate Ninja Blazing are usually the same. So anyways, it's going to, uh, there is going to be a two hour period uh, every single day, Monday through Friday, uh, where we can get the Getting Rich Quick emergency mission. So uh, usually the Getting Rich Quick emergency mission only happens Saturday and Sunday for the full day, but now they have uh, been generous and allow us to play uh, from Monday to Friday as well, but only on designated times. But anyways, it's uh, every time it appears, it's going to appear for two hours, but it's gonna appear several times per day. So for example, 23 o'clock to 1 o'clock PST, that's Pacific Standard Time. And then the next one happens on 4 o'clock to 6 o'clock, again, two hour period. And then the next one happens uh, at 9 to 11, and then 14 to 16, and 19 to 21, all right? So this is the same time every single day, Monday to Friday. So I believe Japanese time uh, should probably be the same. If not, you guys, you know, figure it out uh, when the two hour period time frame is. If you guys are not to uh you know are not in a hurry of getting the roys your coins money just wait till saturday and sunday as usual all right so that's that one and then over here yeah as i stated the ramen report and the scrolls mission have now uh been quote unquote well kind of revamped well not really it's only reduced for stamina and the difficulty all right so difficulty now is uh is easier for the ram and report emergency mission uh it doesn't really save for scrolls probably well yeah probably not because scrolls are pretty 
pretty uh, easy anyways. But anyway, so now for the RAM and stamina report. Uh, I mean, RAM and report stamina. A rank required stamina from 40 all the way down to 20. That's that's awesome. That's a steal, guys, because before I'd still do the B rank for 25. But now 40 to 20, that's awesome stuff. B rank from 25 stamina to 12. C rank from 15 stamina to 6. All right. So that's really good. All right. That's very nice. I, I'm, I'm happy they, they decided to do this. And it's actually a good time the game decided to do this because we need the other stamina to do other stuff, right? Uh, and it makes sense. It made sense before how it caused that much because there weren't, there weren't many uh, things we can do in the game anyways uh, before, right? Anyways, over here, the scrolls, B rank 25 to 12, same thing as Ramen Report. C rank 15 to 6, again, same thing as the Ramen Report. All right, and over here, they're just repeating the getting rich quick uh, emergency mission. I've just went through that, so I'm not going to go through that again. All right, so that's it. And now let's move on to the newer news. All right, so everything I've stated so far, they all apply to both the English and the Japanese version. Okay, so now let's talk about the all new limit break characters. Okay, this also applies to both English and the Japanese version. So again, two other new characters are getting their limit break. This is the Neji, all right? Uh, the uh, unchangeable destiny Neji. And then also we have Tenten, the ninja tool specialist, five stars. So these five stars are getting their um, limit break, all right? So again, the, this list is the same, hasn't changed. So feel free to pause the screen uh, if you guys like and see which of the units you have that can be limit break. And then you guys can, you know, do that, right? And also, uh, in red, they're just telling you which type of trial mission has those crystals or the materials for you to limit break them. So, for example, for uh, the original six stars, Naruto, Sasuke, Kakashi, and Gara, you can get those limit break materials through the third Hokage one, right? And then the other one, Haku, Zawaza, Kakashi, and Sakura, you can get it through uh, the, the Jiraiya one, right? And all the rest is just, I believe... You can get it on the Jiraiya one. Well, depending on the element, at least. Maybe you can get them through the, the third Hokage one. I don't know yet because I haven't really done them. And uh, this is just to indicate that the maintenance is complete. And summons have been added. Event preparations, blah, blah, blah. This applies to the English one. The Japanese one has their own, right? And I'll go through all the events soon, right? All right. So finally, for this uh, news or update, we have the emergency mission required stamina reduced. All right, so this emergency mission does not uh, include the ramen report, getting rich quick, and searching for scrolls because we have talked about that and they are separate. These are for all the other type of emergency mission. All right, so the difficulty is the same. They haven't reduced the difficulty, but the stamina cost for them has now been reduced, which is nice. That means we can grind for longer periods of time or for lower rank players like myself uh i'm what at 90 something i can still do a bit more mission right so c rank uh stamina from 15 to 10 b rank from 30 to 20 a rank from 40 to 30 s rank from 50 to 40 right that's awesome stuff and again doesn't include ram and report scrolls and getting rich quick right but that's really nice everything minus 10 except for c rank all right, so now let's move on to the events. So I'm just going to quickly go over the English versions and then I mean the English events and then I'm going to go to the Japanese version one. All right, so um, I'm just going to go from the bottom up. This one you guys already know. This is the Daydara one and the Sasori one, which I didn't have time to go through because I was moving during that time. Uh, so I'm not going to go through that right now. And then uh, over here, the coming soon, we have the Mist Demon, which is Zabuza. Incoming for Rock Lee, incoming Gara, incoming um, Itachi. We've, you know, we've gone through that before. And over here, we have the new emergency mission. Let's click on that and check it out. So over here, we have the um, event mission, and this time it's feature featuring Kidomaru, and uh, it's a Kidomaru five stars. And this Kidomaru can be awakened to a six stars. All right, that's pretty cool. So uh, there's the B rank mission and C rank mission. So the higher the rank, the higher the drop rate for Kidomaru. All right, so level him up and awaken him to six stars and see what 
his stuff will be so so far we have no information on that uh, i think the japanese version already got that one i'm not too sure again because i was away for the past two weeks didn't see and then over here we have the old stuff the hidden leaves secret ultimate taiju suit the event is now available and then also we currently have the i was gonna call him choji but no what's his name again uh jirobo right so over here he has five stars uh, addition uh, or version he can also go up to a six stars okay so again higher the rank it is the higher the chance for him to drop so check it out for those of you who are playing on the english uh version and then over here we have the sasuke special uh, ninja pro set again uh current one over on the japanese version is sakura i believe so anyways uh if you guys are purchasing that what 30 bucks or 50 bucks set you guys will get um sasuke all right and finally we have the faith in friends summon all right so this is not like the friend summon but this it's just the title okay so this still causes gems and now uh, there's a chance to get choji and also a chance to get um get um kakashi all right so this will last until let's take a look real quick this will last until tuesday 1859 pacific standard time on december 6 okay but check out what we have on japanese version first and that's why i need to make the video today now because we are getting the very first festival all right uh for naruto ultimate ninja blazing i've mentioned about festivals like on my first first video or my first two videos for naruto blazing because i've played a lot of these japanese gacha games and uh most of these gacha games always have some sort of festivals right optc has sugo fest dokken battle has dokken fest uh super Gundam royale has like hot energy festival things like that so on and so forth right every single gacha game has festival and festivals are always the best time to reroll for a brand new account that has op characters uh and for veteran players or old time players uh who have been logging every day to get gems to get you know have, have a better chance at getting some nice and awesome characters right festival exclusive characters all right so anyways let's go through and uh go over to the japanese version now all right so over here we have the japanese version uh, my account so let's go from the bottom up uh again so over here for the japanese version we have the sakura set so we're all the way uh reset to the very first one i don't know why uh the the english version doesn't reset back to the very first package instead it skipped to the sasuke one but anyways um yeah okay so coming up next soon we will have the haku event again and then we'll have the you know sage trials which is the jiraiya one and then we have the Zawusan one oh like going on right now at this moment and then we have rock lee happening right now gara happening right now and itachi happening right now so these four are the fours that i just mentioned for the english version that are coming up soon but it's now um available all right and then over here we have the campaign for both the scrolls and the ramen for the yellow attribute all right the brave attribute happening right now so you guys can go and check out the emergency missions and get those materials if you guys want all right so happening soon will be size of uh, emergency mission okay so again uh five stars available uh when i mean like the drop will be five stars and then it's available for you to awaken him to a six stars i'm actually pretty like liking the current events because ever since we stepped into the shippuden phase uh not only do we see more shippuden characters but all the drops now are five stars if you guys notice and then they're available to be awakened to six stars because before these uh event mission characters are always like four stars and then max is five stars or five stars and then can't even awaken to six stars so you rarely will actually use them but this is pretty good stuff right okay so unless i'm mistaken and i'm just you know not even knowing what i'm talking about but anyways that's what i remember <laughs> all right so happening right now is the kitomaru one uh that we have right here so you guys can see the stats okay so the japanese version is having it right now five stars uh and then available to for six stars okay so his range is large range attack 612 and health is 816 
what he what his skill does his ninjutsu is within his range he will deal um actually no he won't deal any damage there's a 35 percent success rate to immobilize your enemy by for two turns okay and it only targets one enemy so that's his ninjutsu but i don't know what his six stars ninjutsu will be okay so again higher the rank the difficulty the higher the chance of him for him to drop and then over here we have the nine tails event okay so i have gotta go through this with you guys oh it's in the same thing okay because i saw it in another post but i'll read this out so this is the nine tails event that's coming up soon but uh, it's really important you mark down the dates and the time because this is actually like uh, a timed how should i say it it's not really time limited event but kind of like a time limited event but anyways um so um five stars character that you can get all right kushina and is available to upgrade to six stars all right so this five stars version six stars is this one looks really awesome but uh we don't know the stats we don't know what the ninja suit and stuff are yet okay so uh apparently the nine tails that there are three parts that you can attack it's the head the nose well forehead nose and the hands or yeah or, or or the feet of the nine tails right but the hands but uh these are the attack points that you can attack but again i don't we don't know yet but that's just what it says so i would assume it's really similar to naruto shinobi collection if you guys have played that game there are like three parts of nine tails that you can attack so you can uh, probably aim at which to attack okay so uh these are the important uh, dates and time but let's confirm and see if it's the same date and time because it does say important right here so let's read out this one this one can't really be wrong okay so event time december 2nd all right that's the first time this will come out december 2nd 18 o'clock to 20 o'clock only for like two hours all right from 6 p.m to 8 p.m japan's time all right december 2nd japan's time 18 to 20 all right and then at 22 o'clock to 0 o'clock that's 10 at night all the way to 12 at night all right 12 a.m the next morning you should say uh so that's december 2nd these are the two times and then december 3rd to december 4th all right here are the times i believe that's the same time for two days so 11 to 13 18 to 20 22nd to 0 all right again japan's time so go to google and go search up Japan's time and do your own um, um, conversion, all right? Because all of you guys live in different countries, so I, I don't know what time will it be for your country, right? So over here, December 5th to December 6th, 1820, 22 to 0 o'clock, all right? So in total, happens one, two, three, four, five days. But every single day, it only happens like a few times and every time it's only two hours i don't know why they do this this they make it so difficult make it seem so rare for for uh everyone to 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 try to get the kushina but i don't know man it's tough because you know we have work to do and some of you guys have school to attend to it's just hard to <laughs> make this happen sometimes but anyways so over here uh we have the heart gotcha all right so finally uh the japanese version finally has the heart gotcha or am i mistaken because i haven't played for like two weeks uh probably we had this before but i remember there was one that only the english version had that we didn't have before but anyways we're having the heart uh gotcha now uh either the first time or the second time and this time again featuring one of my favorites uh one of still one of the top tier characters in the game so far the six star tsunade right there all right and then we have uh, naruto so yeah i'm really tempted to actually use my gems to pull on this one but here is the you know here is the the finale this is the you know big part and which is why i wanted to make a video today is because we have the naru bude festival right that's naruto blazing festival so they just named it naru, naru, naru blay festival anyways naruto blazing festival and this time featuring uh well introducing a brand new character we have minato all right we have uh the godspeed what is this god's please godspeed uh uh something flash yellow flash 
Minato. I, I just, you know, didn't do like a literal translation, but that's his title, right? So uh, right here, five stars. He can awaken to six stars, all right? The cool part is this part, all right? You guys see this in red? That's his attack range, all right? So his attack range, first time ever, is super large, all right? Or extra large, not super large because you may be in the future, they'll put it super large. But anyways, extra large range, all right? With extra large range, he still does 1462 attack, all right? Usually you only see these kind of attack for small range characters, right? But he does uh, extra large range and does 1462 attack and has a 1298, 1298 health, right? That's pretty intense. And also his ninja suit, it does 11 times, all right? 11 times damage to a single target enemy. So tell me that's not OP, that's broken right now, all right? And usually during this page, they just show the five stars uh, stats, right? So I don't even know what his six star stats will be or what his secret ninjutsu will be. Or is this the secret ninjutsu? Maybe that is, you know? So never mind, this is the secret ninjutsu, but I don't know what his regular ninjutsu is. So I believe this is the six star stats and that's his secret ninjutsu, 11 times damage, very crazy. So. He'll be more broken if it only costs four chakra, man. Uh, anyway, so over here we have the old stuff. We have um, five stars to six stars Itachi. And then we have the monster Gara, this Rock Lee, this Sabuza, all right? So all the raid boss uh, units, all right? The good ones where you need the raid boss drops to awaken them to six stars. I've, I have the Zabuza and Rock Lee myself. I don't have Itachi nor the Gaara, all right? So this time I'm gonna try to aim, well, everyone's gonna try to aim for Minato, but let's see if I'll be lucky enough to get him, okay? So let's see, oh, there's a new field skill as well, all right? So new field, new field skill and also party skill is the Kawarimi Jutsu. Uh, what is that? That's his um, replacement Jutsu. So I believe when he gets hit, Probably there's a chance that he dodges it, all right? So that's pretty insane. Well, it actually says it here, but uh, we'll see how it works. All right, so here, we, whoa, what did I click? All right, never mind. So now you guys actually see what, what my story progress is. But anyways, let's go check out the gacha, all right? So I've clicked the gacha right now, and uh, let's take a look at the rates, guys. So let's check this out. The rates for pickup characters, 5% chance. Ooh, that's not too bad, right? 5% chance for all these pickup characters. So uh, I believe it's 1% each, right? Rock Lee, uh, Sabuza, Gara, Itachi, Minato. And then 10% for 47 uh, other 5 stars. 45% chance for the other 41 4 stars. And 40% chance of the 15 3 stars, okay? And then... Uh, Let's see, this will only last until December 6, 1859. So, you know, it's probably gonna tempt a lot of us to uh, spend some money. Oh, here are the five star stats. So, uh, 1,012 attack, 920 health. What it does is it deals 4.8 times damage to one uh, single target, all right? Within its range. So it's still pretty nice. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna turn up my volume. Whoops, that's kind of loud, but uh, sorry about that, guys. But uh, here we go, because I want to hear Naruto doing his lesson gun. That's that's why. Oh, I'm only ranked 75, not 90. I must be dreaming. All right, or <laughs> all right, here we go. Wish me luck, guys. Come on out, Sasuke. Nice. And can we please have Sakura too? Can I please have Minato? Ooh, one gold. But no Sakura. Probably not getting the Minato. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. All right, I'm really nervous right now, guys. 
Extremely nervous. Let's see. Let's see who I get. Oh, I'm so nervous. Please give me Minato. Oh, oh man. I wanted to rage quit right there. Oh, <laughs> excuse me. <coughs> well, 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 well. I don't know what to say, guys. Ah. Anyways, good luck to all of you guys and girls who will be polling. I hope you guys will have much better luck than I am. Like, um, yeah. Sorry, guys. I just ah. Uh, I can't collect myself. I uh, thank you, everyone, for watching. And uh, if you guys have any comments, feel free to leave some comments down in the comment section down below. And if you guys enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. And if you guys haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe for more quality contents. And as always, I'll see you all at my next video. Take care and bye now.